just take this the way I do it. You can pin it if you want, but I find that the pins just get in my way and I don't want to mess with that. So, I mean, even if you just do it like that, a little. going. Then you're going to want to switch to a zigzag. And I do kind of a long stitch on that. All right. All right. And I'm just going to keep zigzagging, backing up as needed until you have it the size you want. started. That bad. A lot of backing up. you prefer me to fast forward not show any mistakes or should I keep the mistakes in there and make it real really does happen to everyone I would think
check it. See, we're getting some mistakes. Easy fixes. decide what size bowl you want. You could stop here and have a small bowl. You would just turn it like this and start sewing that way to make it a bowl. But I want to make mine a little bigger. too big so I'm going to start to make that bigger. Alright, there's different ways you could do this. Yeah, have this chalk. Might work. Turn it over. There. Just kind of roughly. It does not have to be perfect. Then I am going to make these little wings. Just no particular way. Gotta decide if it's better with this. Two lines now. It really does not matter. Let's see which one's better. Oh, the white's good too. I think I can see the white better. This is upholstery chalk, pretty cool. And I have all these colors. Amazon for the win. Look at that, it's gonna be a star. I never know quite how it's gonna turn out till I do it. <laughs> That's half the fun. We need to cut out And then, 
Okay, after thinking about this for a minute, I think I want, I don't want it to be this big. So I'm going to cut it down. Make it any size you want. How about this? You can kind of judge it once you've, and I probably should take this out. That way you can see. Get an idea. goes well with the zigzag. It's not perfect. You could do it perfect if you want. and see how much their baskets are. You can just make them yourself. Do is I'm gonna go every other one. So I'm gonna go over and then I'm gonna go under, if that makes sense. And you'll be able to watch me. So take this one out. I'm gonna start right there. The little thread there or fabric, so okay. Now we went out on that one, so we're going to go under on this one. And I still can feel where that's at. So. Just reverse each time.
or turn it like that and start making the bowl. So this is where you make the decision what you, what you want. So now that I'm going, I've got it the way I want it. I'm going to start tilting it as hard as I can to get a steep edge. If you went more gentle, it's going to go more out. So this is your decision on what you want. You can see how it's already curving just by doing that. Isn't that great? You could stop here and just have it like that. go farther. It's nice to take it off and just kind of see what you think. I'm gonna go more. I mean, I could go a little bit more. That would hold some stuff. Even the back is pretty neat. <laughs> Look at that. Put this by your bed. Hold all your things you need at night. I'll go around just a little bit. 